So here is the set. Um, looks pretty cool. Um, I, I've shown the Mickey figure before, Pepper Potts and her business suit here. Um, a, a box full of ammo. Um, as you can see there, a nice little keypad on the top. Close that up. The silver ones are for this six stud shooter here. Pretty cool. And the three, the orange ones are for the little tiles. So yeah, um, it has like the repulsors here. Pretty cool. Also repulsors on the, on the bottom. So that's pretty cool. Um, this piece is a glow in the dark piece. So that's pretty cool. Um, it's nice, like how, you know, suspension stuff and, you know, it's like really mechanical looking. So that's also, also pretty cool how, how it was in the movie. Um, this, um, mechs are always take a while to set up and, uh, get it how you want it. But, um, yeah, if you open the lid here, I mean, the, the head, it's a nice print there. Um, you have Obadiah Stan here, sitting or standing, whatever you want, um, for him to control it. Um, <clears throat> the only thing that is disappointing about this set is Lego really likes to make mechs, and that's <clears throat> it's always going to be a thing. Uh, I guess they sell well, and... Um, they continue to make them, but this was not a very good choice. Um, it got a lot of detail in there, but this is totally not to scale to what it should have been because it wasn't this big at all. I mean, look at the size comparison. Iron Man, Iron Monger. No, that's it's way too big. Um, maybe a third or a fourth of the size would have been good. Um, cause it's, it's, it's a little bit bigger than Iron Man, but you know, not that big. Anyways, they got, put a lot of detail into it though. And, um, it's just another mech, I guess, some stickers and, um, some nice minifigures. First time of getting a Mark III Iron Man. And, um, yeah, this Pepper Potts figure is pretty cool too. First time getting an Obadiah stand. So, um, it's always a plus. Yeah. So that'll be all. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.